Mongols and Mongol history have really captured the interest of audiences since the start of cinema and the story of these mounted warriors becoming world conquerors has been told many times over the decades and this video will give you my recommendations of the top 5 historical movies you need to watch if you are curious to find out more about Mongol history and the unique traits and skill that led them to conquering much of the known world during their peak. But before we begin, don't forget if you love anything to do with historical movies or historical TV shows, then subscribe to my channel History Spark. At number 5 is Genghis Khan, the 2005 direct to TV documentary movie which gives a simplified and easy to follow glimpse of the complicated life of the legendary Mongol conqueror Genghis Khan. This documentary film tells the story of Timurjin and his eventual growth to becoming the mighty Genghis Khan who will terrorize China and many other countries with his Mongol hordes. This movie benefits from great acting, fantastic battle scenes and it presents a multifaceted look at Genghis Khan's life and career. However, the movie is very rapid paced and it does really rush the ending and the third act of the film. However, if you're looking for an introduction to Mongol history in the 2005 movie, Genghis Khan is the perfect place to start that journey. And number 4, it is Furious, a Russian epic film which covers the siege of Raizon by the Mongols in 1237 and the plot of this movie is based off of the tale of the destruction of Raizon. It tells about the actions of Russian knight Patek Lavrat who led the heavily outnumbered Russian forces against the Mongol hordes of Batu Khan. This was the first Russian based historical movie I had seen in a long time and I really enjoyed it as the plot was simple and easy to follow if a little bit unoriginal and the main character was fairly well developed and believable as well. Also the movie did a really great job of bringing the power of the Mongols to the screen in a really fantastic manner which is really believable and engaging. Fierce is a bit lacking in terms of cinematography and set pieces but overall for a B-grade unknown Russian film, I really enjoyed Furious and I think all viewers of this channel will do so as well, especially those who have an interest in Mongol history. At number 3, it is The Horde, a historical drama which takes us directly into the middle of the political intrigues which are occurring in the Golden Horde during the mid-1300s and the primary focus of this film is around the events that occurred when Saint Alexius tried to heal the mother of the Khan, Taidula Khatun from blindness and the aftermath that would follow as well as the political intrigue of the Golden Horde with several factions trying to increase their own power within the Khanate. The plot here is very interesting, the acting is decent and for a low budget Mongol historical film there's not really much to complain about as it is covering a very little talked about part of history and it is a film that I think more fans of historical films should be made aware of. And number 2, it is War of the Arrows, a fictional historical drama where a skilled archer sets out on a solo mission to rescue his sister from the Manchu invaders who have kidnapped her during her wedding after raiding her village and causing massive destruction and mayhem. This movie has the intense battle and action scenes we are used to from South Asian cinema and this movie is literally one man on a mission to do whatever is necessary to bring his sister back home. The acting is brilliant, the battle scenes are brutal and there are many unexpected plot twists that will keep the viewer glued to their seats. The story and world building is a bit weak here but for anyone looking to get a better understanding of Mongols and their impact on the lives of just regular civilians then War of the Arrows is the perfect film for you. And the top spot on this list goes to Mongol, a biographical film that came out in 2007 which magnificently tells the story of Genghis Khan from his childhood to his rise of becoming the warlord that finally unites all the Mongol factions into one deadly unit. Mongol is the first film of a yet to be released trilogy series and as of 2019 the sequel to Mongol has been confirmed to be in production. This movie does a great job of slowly building the story of Genghis Khan and his family and it spends a surprisingly long amount of time delving into his troubled childhood and the huge number of obstacles and struggles he would have to endure before even becoming a minor warlord in Mongolia. Mongol has great acting especially by Tadanobu Asano as Timujin being the particular standout for me in this film. The third act of this film is very rushed and it depicts Timujin's rise to power a bit too quickly for my liking. 
But other than that critique, Mongol is the first movie you should watch if you want to learn more about Mongol history and the life of Genghis Khan. So lastly, I just wanted to say thank you so much for watching this video. If you did enjoy it, please do like and share this video with others. And if you haven't done so, subscribe to my channel History Spark as I post videos about historical movies and historical TV shows each and every week. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.